I just don't see Sephiroth having a really fun time playing against Palutena, and I don't think anyone has a good time playing against Snake. So I think that uh, this is probably the best matchup we could see. Trying to keep in mind of the C4 sitting there on the side platform, and just, you know, we'll have to see where the trades come in and how much does Snake want to trade with Palutena. That, that is something that I don't know if I would be able to tell you off the, off the cuff. But, you know, keeping this one even just because of how much trading is going on, you know, I want to see if, with these trades, if uh, Street Design is able to, you know, combo off of any of these explosions coming away from the grenades. And he's having a hard time setting up, of course, Stash not wanting to just let him do whatever he wants to do. And creating the space and not able to quite, I think he might have been trying to parry. I don't think he forgot he was holding a grenade. And Stash able to just run his advantage state through the wall, but getting hit by the up smash there. That might have been a little bit of a hit. Oh, okay. Might have been a little bit of a hit to the ego. Going for a ride here, and he was trying. That's frame one grenade is gone. You know, I, I can't say that I wanted <laughs> that I wanted Palutena to just take the train, but frame one grenade is dumb. But Street Design able to take that stock off pretty easily with a pretty heavy deficit here to come back from. I can't say this is going to be an easy one for him whatsoever. And gets caught by that C4 on the platform, not looking for it this time, trying to get the the person the player stick. Trying to maybe catch a jump there. It's just Snake throwing grenades. I, I, it's hard to con, and gets caught by the same exact thing. You know, just it's advantage stay up air. It is generally where all these hits are coming from, and cleaning out these stocks very quickly. And now all of a sudden, that close game that we had at the first stock just became a full stock lead for Stash. And, up airs all over, and I think the grenades are just what Street Design is trying to go for right now. I don't know where that last grenade just went. I didn't see it explode at all. Neither did I see where that Nikita went, but the explosive flame trying to take it, but it gets a stock from the C4 that was hidden on the ground. We just have to see if he's going to be able to bring this one back and not quite able to bring it back. So clean, a fresh, clean stock from Stash and Banning Town and Kalos. So trying to get maybe some smaller stages. I don't know who's going to benefit more. Maybe they just gentlemen back, to, or not gentlemen back, but maybe he just goes straight back to PS2 because I don't know if he wants to have to deal with those top platforms, but going for Smashville instead. I don't know. I think maybe he's just looking to control the center platform with the C4. Uh, Trying to get maybe a little bit of color change just to, you know, blend into the background. This is an exciting matchup for whatever it's worth. It, it is These guys playing going toe-to-toe, -to -toe, neither one of them just wants to sit back and just let the other play the game. And again, Stash, Stash being very patient and doing a little bit more waiting than he I, you usually see him do. He's not usually one to just stop and, oh wow. He was ready for the teleport on stage, just over, overstated it a little bit, or overshot it a little bit. And that's some quick percent. And I just, I definitely see uh, Street Design having to work harder for his percent than Stash is at the moment. And getting the tech, oh man, that was definitely not what I was expecting. I was hoping he was, not hoping, but I was hoping to see a combo off of that into the C4. Spot dodge into the up tilt. And this is a much better lead that, uh, that Street Design has over Stash. We're just going to have to see where Street takes this. How long is he going to be able to you know, keep Palutena out of his way and out of his reaches? And not get hit by an up, up air or a back air off the Cypher. Explosive Flame is such a scary move to just have to sit and wait through. I was say, there's a grenade somewhere, but he gets hit by the up smash and trying to get a little bit of a slip off the platform. 
Street Design's done a good job with all of his C4 and grenade placements, and is definitely understands where his where he wants to control on stage. But I, I just I don't see quite. Oh, and misses the air dodge or misses the platform, but gets the up smash anyway. Doesn't quite take it. I gotta say I was expecting a little bit more out of the up, of the up smash there, but the up tilt's gonna take that one anyway, and we have an even game, ladies and gentlemen. We're just gonna see how far does Stash take this train. And that is basically 80% that he just got off of uh, one little bit, and he definitely wanted that, and the air dodge off stage just cannot get back from it. So. That's going to be first, or that's the second game here. And now, we wait and see where they want to go. So Street Design feels like it wasn't necessarily the stage's fault that, uh, that he lost that one. So he wants to go back, going back to the original color, maybe it was an accidental press on that second color change. So the score thing that's Stash definitely has a, a pretty commanding, I think, mental lead on... He, he's playing very strong today. Uh, I don't know if he feels like he's being quite as smooth for the last time we were here, but last time he was also got upset for, by Fuchsia, who wasn't able to come in, but that was not quite a zero to death, but man, oh man, was that a pretty start from Stash. And I think this, you know, Stash, definitely someone who plays... Just one of the best advantage state players I, I've seen, maybe getting a little overzealous on that one. Uh, and again, Stash coming out of winner's side, he had to come out of losers to win the last tournament that we played against, where he played against Abe. And uh, playing out of winner's side, I think it's just a little bit easier. I think he might just be feeling himself. He's, you know, we're edging into top eight here, I do believe. And he's just, uh, he's feeling himself, I think. You know, going for. A couple extra down airs, knows he has a, a stock to play with and an extra game to play with, or, or extra two games to play with, and, and no panic air dodges off the ledge there, and I think he's just wanting to take this one home. Street Design not ready to give it up just yet. Not quite able to take that one off. And this is a lot of damage for Palutena to be sitting on, especially against Snake. And that up, up air, Absolutely just cleaning up stocks for Stash. Probably going for a parry into an up tilt on that one. And I believe Street Design may have seen it coming. Placing it out in the C4. I honestly forgot that one was there too, so. Street Design absolutely working in C4s and not, you know, trying to find signs of life here. Not wanting to just give it up for any reason and misses the tech. That was a tough one. And uh, that was a good game coming out of Stash. Honestly, 